Hello kittens, Silver here, and today I'm going to be reviewing my Uni Toys Ocelot plush. Now, Uni Toys is a German-made brand, for those of you who aren't familiar. So I did buy this particular plush on eBay Germany a couple of years back. I'm thinking maybe two years ago or so. Uh, unfortunately, this was the very last one that the store had in stock at the time. So I kind of lucked out there. This, uh, this particular plush is no longer manufactured which is unfortunate, but hopefully, who knows, maybe Unito Unitoys will re-release this at some point down the road because they are still very much in the business of making plush. And I think sometimes once in a while they actually uh, do end up coming out with plush that they formerly manufactured. So, uh, so fingers crossed because uh, this is definitely one of the stars of their collection, in my opinion, especially if you like wildcat plushies. So as you can see from her little tag here, she is a, a 24 inch size ocelot cat, so she is a very, very sizable plush, um, which is definitely advantageous in my opinion. Um, and it's funny because it says uh, with belt here, because this plush did come with a, with a harness originally. It was just sort of this, uh, this brown, sort of plain fabric affair, which kind of uh, seemed a bit incompatible with an ocelot. I think just by default, Uni Toys always puts harnesses on their larger size plush. It makes sense for, for the dog breeds and stuff, but, but they put it on regardless of the, the species or, or animal that, uh, <laughs> that, that, they're, that they're making. So uh, I did not think that it suited this particular plush all that well. So I just took my little seam ripper and took that out and gave her this very nice uh, rhinestone encrusted collar here with these uh, nice little gold sparkle details. And I added the little gold bell just for a little extra accessory. So I think that suits her much, much more nicely. Uh, now I'll give you a look at her tush tag back here as well with the Uni Toys logo on it. So there it is. And this plush is really just magnificently detailed. It's um, really one of just the most lifelike realistic ocelot plushies that I've seen to date. Um, so as you can see, she has these beautiful golden eyes, which I think also really kind of complement that collar I gave her very well. Um, and I love the fact they have that, that vertical slit, which feline plushies really should, in my opinion, um, as opposed to, you know, the more commonplace round eyes. And there's just so much airbrush detail on this plush um, between the spots on the forehead. Um, you see it here around the nose and the mouth, on other areas of her face, and also on the lining of her ears. Around the eyes, it's just chock full of detail. And she has a pink plastic nose and black plastic whiskers on either side. And you've got those nice uh, whisker follicles here. And you can see there's sort of a lighter, uh, a lighter cream colored fabric around the eye while her head is just this nice beige color. And then actually the, uh, the fur on the body is a slightly lighter shade of beige than on her head. And she has all these beautiful spots and this nice brown color that are lined with a darker brown fabric. And you can also see the patterning on her tail is quite different from the uh, the rest of the spots on her body, kind of more of a stripey look. And her underside is all this nice light cream color. And she's also very floppy as well, which um, is another huge plus. Uh, you could probably sort of hear that she's got some beans in her backside and plenty of squishiness in the middle. And also the backs of her ears, we don't want to neglect either because that's another really nice um, extra detail that they, uh, that they included. So you can see they're sort of lined in this nice soft black sort of minky style fabric. And you've got the white fabric on the inside of it. And just again, just the size of this plush is, is definitely prodigious. It's, <laughs> it's great for those of you who are tall like I am and um, need a good cuddle companion. This particular cat definitely fits the bill. It's, it's always nicer to have a, a little bit more to love when it comes to plush, in my opinion anyway. 
So that is the Uni Toys Ocelot, uh, and who, by the way, I named Nikita. And she's definitely just one of the jewels of my Wildcat plush collection. So I would, again, highly, highly recommend her if you're able to find her. I do believe, actually, that there is a smaller version of this plush with the exact same design, just just on a much smaller scale. I'm not sure what the exact dimensions are, maybe maybe like a 12-inch size or so, but um, definitely spring for this one if, if you manage to, uh, to find her. She's absolutely gorgeous. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing Nikita, and I will be back again soon with some more plush goodness for you. Bye, everybody.